guys, this is Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode four of the Honor Student at Magic High School. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one. Hold on. Nope. Let me do it again. In three, two, one, go. There you go. <clears throat> Oh, they got just something to do for you and your brother. Poor baby. I mean, I hate the fact that they're, like, letting her out on, like, not in on this. But they're only doing it because they've done so much for them. Yeah, but it's not anything bad. Oh, hun. Is it bad that I want a head pat from him? I'm like... Every single time, she's like, "Oh, wait, wait, wait!" Every girl that gets close to my brother, <laughs> I'm like, oh. no, I'm sorry, I didn't like that. She, because of the fact that she is a bad guy, she's not only thanking him for doing this, but she also has to be close to him. It's, it's okay, but it's complicated. Poor baby, she is like <laughs> Miyuki, like who the fuck? I can't. I can't. Precious baby. Like, I feel so bad for her because dead eyes. Like, she feels like every girl that, like, comes around Tatsuya is going to take her from him. I mean, take him from her. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, yes, I get into the fact that she's like, you know, I you, mm, gotta stay on my ground. Gotta mark my territory. But boo boo boo. <laughs> boo boo. Honey. That one strands in my hair that I don't want. Where the fuck is it? Oh, it's cute. Just important stuff, not mm, relationship thing. <laughs> Miyuki! <laughs> oh, poor baby. Oh, honey. You gotta establish your ground. That too. No. Oh. Yeah, but not really. Like one minute she's like confident about it, and then she'll get so shy. And it's so cute. But I did like that orange top. That was cute. I would wear that. Mm. 
Are you okay? Mute. Excuse me. She knows. Excuse me. Of course. Actually, no, put this in front of my face. Yeah, and he doesn't want you to get hurt. Not after that. I just, uh, y you know, why couldn't you just give us, like, a little bit more on that? Like,
Mm-hmm. Of course not. Yeah, especially your aunt. Because she's not going to use the other two because they don't make an appearance until season two. But you two, yeah, you're more valuable right now. It's just making me fall more in love with him, and I can't. He, you know what? Let's just go ahead and say this. He's not in this as much as he is in the previous season because it's her story, but he's in it just as much. And I'm just like, oh my, I can't. Like, this is only episode four. You guys, I really think this is a bad idea. Maybe you should have sold Miyuki or Tatsuya. Because, like, okay, let's say, yeah, because you're going to tell him, of course. What if he finds out? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, but should you once again continue tailing him like this? Exactly. This is a bad idea. I wouldn't have gone after him. Like it's, they're part of a terrorist group, so you you think they're gonna have time to sit here and be like, "Yeah, let me tell you my life story." Of course, they would use cash jamming on them because, of course, to stop them and then immediately just kill them like that.
Uh, I mean, come on now. She OP as fuck. I mean, at least maybe at the same wavelength as her brother. Mm. Oh. Well. <laughs> yeah, they just wanted to repay him back. You guys. Yuki got this. Guess you're too OP. Someone needs to keep their mouth shut. No, babe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. May as well just go ahead and attack the school from the inside. Duh.
And here it comes. Okay, so now my biggest thing is, especially with the fact is, I didn't think they, I, I thought they would have shown a little bit more of the Blanche attack in this week's episode, but of course we're going to get into next week. But I, I do love the fact that, I mean, hold on, Jesus was like, yeah, we're going to repay him because of what happened last week, so yeah, but still, I understand, you know, you don't want to tell Miyuki about the situation because you didn't want to worry her, but at the same time, that is your friend. If you love and care for her, you need to tell her, and, you know, she can help, because we all know Miyuki is overpowered as fuck. I mean, hello, the situation of, like, when Lena saw how OP Miyuki was in season two. Come on now. That's the reason why, you know, she and Tatsuya can't really have the life that they want to have because they're still, like, watching their backs because you don't know what's going to happen and such. And this is kind of also why I wish, like, if this show gets a season two, I would like to see, like, her POV of season two and maybe her POV of the movie and such, I mean, because, like, Miyuki in the movie, she was barely in the movie. She's in the movie, like, a couple of times. I mean, because the whole entire time they were just on an island. But she doesn't have, like, that big of a role as Tatsuya does because the whole fucking series is mainly about Tatsuya with, like, a teeny tiny bit of Miyuki. And so when Miyuki does get that time to shine... It, it's good, and I really enjoy it for what it is because of the fact is once again, she is one of my favorite characters of the show, besides, like, Erica, um, Honoka Shizuku, um, Emmy, um, the president, and a couple others. Even though, like, his... It, by the time, like, what, season three comes for this show, um, Kanaha Nozono probably won't even be in the show because her character essentially graduates. Because, no, because not even by that, like, by the time the movie came out, her and what's her face were already out of high school. So what would you still do for those characters? Because it feels like there's still a lot of unanswered questions and such there, but it's like how would you establish that, you know? But now since we're going into the terrorist attack and everything, um I kind of now want to see, like, what else is going to happen. Because, of course, this is the exact same episode, but in Miyuki's POV. Um, because there's a point where in this episode, in the original series, I think they... Tatsuya and Miyuki, they split up. So, and I think Miyuki goes with Honoka and Shizuku to go get some other things done. And then eventually she meets back up with her brother. Um, because Tatsuya, Erika, um and somebody else, I don't remember their name, they go, they go up to, like, I think the main entrance of the school, because that's when they're going to find out that, uh, Mibu is a traitor among them and such. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what we're going to see next week. Yeah, 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 yeah. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode four of the Honor Student at Magic High School. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Saturday for episode five. Bye, guys.